good you guys welcome back to my channel i wanted to pull some cards i was just sitting here and i was like you know let me just get my cards and pull some cards and see what's going on let's see if we can get a message i haven't used my kawaii tarot in a while so we're going to use that i'm feeling the energy feels pretty sweet so let's see what messages we have make sure you take what resonates and leave the rest you guys all right, so we got the five of wands. You guys know my dogs are out of control. So if you hear them in the back, they're walking around. I have huskies. So if you know huskies, you know that, you know, they're crazy. <laughs> so yeah, we have the five of wands and then the ten of cups and then the six with the lovers here. With the lovers here. So this is obviously about love. Three of swords in reverse, clarifying the five of wands. Let's see. I'm hearing regret. Six. Six of coins in reverse, clarifying the ten of cups. Okay, I'm getting someone didn't listen to their intuition here. This could be you or someone else. You could be a water sign. All right, we have the eight of wands in reverse, clarifying the six, I mean the lovers. I keep saying, saying six because we have a lot of sixes here, but sixes being like um, Virgo energy, like very diligent, very like somebody feels like they made a mistake here. So someone feels like they made a mistake and I'm hearing like a lot of regret. There's somebody feels like their decision caused something to come to a halt here. This person, it could be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius that feel like they chose wrong here. Somebody's re in regret about feeling that they chose wrong. Knight of Wands in reverse here. So I feel like someone did something prematurely and now they're regretting it. Let's see. The magician in reverse, yeah. I'm hearing the grass ain't greener on the other side by Chris Brown. Let's see. But yeah, with this magician here, this is um, Gemini energy, Virgo energy too as well. So I'm getting something about someone moving too hastily or they cut their, said something about their words or something like that. Like they, their words were very, um, something about like, let me clarify, because I feel like someone feels ashamed here. Because there's a knight and wand, knight energy and page energy here. So someone feels less than about something. Page of swords in reverse. Ten of ten of coins in reverse, yeah. Okay, so I'm getting the whoever thought that the grass was greener on the other side when it comes to this relationship. They could have chose someone else. They could have um, I'm hearing road off into the sunset or something like that. This person feels like the conflict that they caused you with this five of wands. They feel like something about it will never be able to be the same again. Let's see. We got the three of wands and then the nine of coins. And the ten of swords in reverse. Okay, so I'm hearing someone doesn't want this cycle to end with you. You could be a water sign. You could be a Libra here. But what I'm getting here with this nine of coins, I feel like, because I'm hearing this song called Better Off Without You by Aquilo. It's an older song, but I really like that song. But I'm hearing someone feels better off without someone. Let me get more energy. We got the nine of cups in reverse. Someone feels like they should have gave you what you needed but they didn't i feel like this person may have been listening to someone else something about feeling like they misjudged the situation or misjudged you misread you or mishandled you king of cups yeah now this part and the king of pentacles okay okay what it is whoever you are you may have some new options now because I'm getting like a lot of threes, like threes company. So I feel like you may be dating around now. And these are people who are more stable because this person carries, the person that we're talking about carries a lot of night and page energy. So this person was very slow to move 
were slow to give you something or they felt like they can just do what they want to do and then come back whenever they felt ready. But I'm hearing now with you're dating other people who are emotionally stable and um, who have a lot to offer here. So this is you dating probably multiple people at one time, just enjoying yourself. And this person may know that you're finally getting what you deserve. So that's why they may be in regret about a lot of this conflict that they caused. So what did they, what did they do? So I'm unsure if it's about another person. I did see the three of swords in reverse, but this could also be a way that they treated you, a way that they communicated with you, wasn't fair to you. Something about like the wool, pulling the wool over your eyes with the um, magician card. So yeah, okay, this person, something about, I'm getting this person is someone that may have taken a stab at you when you were already down or not feeling like yourself or like you waited for this person to like open up or, or something about like you were always met with the door shut and shut in your face or something like that. You felt shut out here. So now that we got the nine of swords, so the nine of swords is someone that feels very, um, very betrayed or very like knows that a cycle is coming to an ending but also with the four of wands in reverse here this is someone that didn't like stand up with you for you or didn't like really take the precautions to make you feel safe secure and heard so that's why this person is definitely regretting here let's see let's see your energy here we got the queen of cups in reverse in the sun card Okay, so I'm getting, this is good energy though. Even though the Queen of Cups is in reverse, I feel like this is good energy because I feel like you're someone who is really starting to figure out what you need. If I'm talking to a feminine here, I'm figuring out that this situation that happened with this person, like you were able to understand the type of boundaries that you want for your life now. And so with you dating, you're like, you know, these are good, good. These two masculines are good as far as like, good catches but i think that you're not really trying to take anything super serious at the moment you're like you know what given what i've been through like i really want to just enjoy my time like i'm not in a hurry to like rush the process of trying to like settle down in a relationship because so i feel like this person definitely really hurt you like i could feel it in my heart like the little pain that you get you know you know you know when you've been through a little breakup or something like that you know that little pain that you feel inside like like something's like ripping your heart out like that's what i'm feeling right now so we have the sun card here this could be a fire sign you could be a fire sign here but i'm also seeing with the moon card here pisces energy so this could be that dynamic, like a Leo and a Pisces dynamic here. Let's see. This person could also be an Aquarius. All right, we got the Nine of Cups here. So whoever you are now, you're in your receiving mode. You're just chilling. You're having a good time. You're doing your thing. You're not too worried about, like, making things happen with people. And this is coming off very attractive. All right, so this person, the person that broke your heart, this person wants to balance things out. This person really wants to rush in. This person wants to ask for another chance. They want to ask for a equal give and take. But I feel like you're calling BS on that for some reason. We're going to see why, but we got the justice card in reverse. I feel like this was something that happened more than once. And you're wondering, are they sad that they really hurt you or are they regretting the fact that they got caught and then that's the fact that they're the things that they're doing or the relationship or whatever they're trying to pursue right now is not working so i feel like you're like look is it because like of that or is it because like you just you got caught and your shit is not in order or like the person that you thought that you was going you know be with is not you know king of wands in reverse so it's giving that is giving that ego. It's giving that ego that's a little shattered right now with the King of Wands in reverse, clarifying the temperance here. So I feel like someone just wants to feel better. They want to feel better. And this person doesn't want to have conflict. We got the Five of Swords in reverse. So this person doesn't want to fight about this. But I feel like it's more so like so they can get their confidence back with the Six of Wands here. And then the Four of Coins. This person wants you to, it's like they're hoping that there's still a little window left in your heart for this person so that they can come through. Let's see. I want to ask about these new partners in a minute. Let's see, Eight of Swords in reverse, yeah. 
But see, this person isn't, it, it isn't like that genuine with this person. This person doesn't understand, like, when you hurt someone, you don't get to tell somebody, because it's like this person is, like, trying to say, like, oh, like, well, it was this or it was that. Like, you don't get to explain and you don't get to tell people that you didn't hurt them when you hurt them. This is that person that will try to, like, gaslight you into thinking or making you believe that something was going on wrong with them when they were just a shitty person the whole time, right? So with the Knight of Pentacles, like definitely carrying that Knight energy, like slow to really give, slow to invest, but they were investing in everything else but you. But I think they thought that you were just like going to be there. So it's like they're not even looking at themselves. They're not seeing the, the mistakes and the things that they know that they need to handle here. So... I really want to talk about the new partners here because this person is irritating me. Yeah, this person is irritating me for some odd reason. Because it's like, you knew what you was doing. You knew what you was doing and you had the opportunity to like be with. It's like giving you had the opportunity to be with me. And now that you see me over here getting wined and dined and like living my best life and all these options. More than just, because I'm getting like here, you're someone who has options in life. Seven of Cups. Yeah, you're someone who has options in life. You could put your energy into many different things right now. You don't have to like settle for being with a partner here. And I think before you were just like you really wanted a relationship or you really tried to like make things happen with this person. We got the sun in reverse. So that's funny because we got the sun here in the other deck that we have we have the sun in the upright and then we have the sun in reverse now so this person feels like something about like they're having to address a certain wound that they're having a childhood wound something that is connected to their ego maybe not feeling good enough not feeling seen not feeling heard yeah four of pentacles this could be around family this could be around them not feeling stable within their environment with how they grew up and, and their parents and so on and so, so forth. But the thing is with this person, it's like they don't want to deal with the pain. They want to try to come back just to cover up the pain. It's not like they're, they're, they're happy to like make something work with you. So with the Six of Pentacles, like they're energy where it's like their self energy their get up and go about things is not genuine it's just the fact that they feel like they don't have anybody like stroking their ego or giving to them or gifting them with things or lifting them high up on a pedestal you know and you know just saying we all make mistakes and things like that but this person is like a, a i'm hearing chronic with it like it's always this person always is like has something else on the side or like something something to try to always have the upper hand even just the way that they talk to people but this person it comes from them being hurt and not feeling heard in their life so yeah the king of cups here so it's like this person is like very emotionally manipulative very emotionally manipulative right here so this is someone who understands emotions really well understood this is someone that understood when they were younger how to get use their emotions to get what they want to get a certain reaction or to hide when to hide their emotions when to cover them up when to mask them and they use it now in certain relationships to keep people on strings or to keep people online or to get whatever they need out of their relationships so we have the page of wands it's because they feel they have a desire to be passionate and to love and be loved but this person here it's like they only have like this page energy it's just like desire it's like they don't know how to implement it into like action here but also with the three of cups here this person likes to be seen in a certain light so i feel like because you're not falling in line or you're not giving to this person or you just don't care it's like i feel like this person is watching you just not care and live your life you could be looking different could be dressing different i'm seeing like black skirts like latex or spandex i'm feeling like really spicy energy here so yeah i'm picking up some of that like i'm hearing like um latin music too so you could be like you know being real spicy and just doing your thing here but i'm seeing like with the three of cups here like this person likes to be needed likes to be seen likes to have an upper hand they it's like this is the person that will go out you know how like some people like some masculines i've seen it in like my ex for instance it's like he would have to go out and he would have to like buy all the drinks and want everybody to know that he had the money and that he was like buying the drinks and even if like we invited other people to go out to dinner with us it was always like oh he'll pick up the tab and i'm like 
you know, you could let somebody else like share in like your company and pay for the tab. Like other, his other friends wanted to pay for the tab sometimes and he never would. It's like he had to have that over everyone. And then when a situation arise where he would feel, feel like he wasn't heard, then it was pretty much everybody else's fault as to why like he wasn't like getting his needs met. And it's like, no, because you, you're always like quick ahead to try to like do something just to gain like you know just to have like the upper hand you know so we got the the ten of pentacles clarifying the four of pentacles here so if in reverse here so i feel like this person realizes that something about if they were a little bit more open they could have had like a ten of pentacles with you they could have had more than what they were like offering you they knew that you were offering more than that but see with the ten of swords here in reverse this person doesn't want to stop communication with you completely i feel like this person has a way in i feel like it's more, more so i'm getting through instagram or social media or something like that they may not have your phone number but they may send you like little i'm getting like little checkup messages here and there but it's really just because when they only they only test you when they see something like you're going out on a date or if you post pictures of flowers or you know how us girls do you know how us girls do like when we're getting spoiled like we post the pictures of our flowers or of our dates and then we don't show our our date's face but like we're, we're showing that we're there with somebody it's like that type of thing this person will definitely it causes a lot of conflicts in their head with this five of wands it causes a lot of conflict in their head and they're and they're over here like acting like everything is fine like but watching your social media like oh my gosh like i can see someone getting like pumped up like just really like i'm getting seeing somebody and they could like drink when when they look at your page at night or something like that this person like ruminates over it yeah let's see with the nine of wands i'm getting that they're more mad at themselves it's like they look back and they see all these this opportunity where they had time to put in the effort to to show you that they cared a little bit more to to invest in the relationship or something like that and i think this people this person they just were something about like because i'm getting something here about like status here we got the devil on the bottom capricorn they could be into their work or they could use things to get people online or like material things or mon monetary possessions that sort of thing they they could use that as a means of like a vehicle to like mask their emotions that's what i'm picking up this person needs a lot of healing this person needs a lot of like healing on their lower chakras their root chakras sacral and solar plexus mainly their solar plexus because the space that they're doing this from is really like it's like coming off from a hurt space and i think that you're the fact that you're being doted on now and that you're seeing like so much here like you you don't these this new people that are in your life right now these people give you that communication i feel like you're with someone more in particular i think it's the the king of pinnacles that we were getting this person it's like you're more you have more communication with this person this person doesn't just show you that they care about you they they actually tell you and they they constantly pursue you it's like this person is someone that's into planning and looking out and they communicate the actions that they're going to take with you like they could paint a picture for you like i see this for us i see us doing this i see us investing in that i see us like getting closer or this is someone that really communicates with you and the fact that what I like about this person is the fact that they're like really stable within themselves and they're okay if you don't express as much. They know that by them continuously like being open and honest with you about the fact that they're there for not just, you know, a physical reason, but they really truly enjoy your company here. Yeah, they know at some point, like with the death card here, that this the relationship could transform. And you could like this person more than you're liking the other one. But also, too, for some of you guys that haven't, like, saw, got the other person that's coming in just yet. I feel like with the other person, the, um, what is it? The other person, the king of wands i feel like the other person is like someone that you could just have fun with and that may be a newer one for you but this king of pentacles is definitely someone that is like look i'm communicating with you i really want to be with you outside of just xyz that sort of thing yeah but we also have the devil here it came back out yeah so i'm getting like this person wants to rear their head i'm hearing like rear their head <laughs> into the situation i feel like they're going to confront you here so let's see Tell me more about the devil. What is the per what is this person going to do? What is this person's actions? Because I'm hearing like confronting you very angry angrily. 
like why this why that i'm hearing a lot of questions this person may ask you a lot of questions ace of pentacles this person may come back and express the fact that they want to start over and just give you all these things that they didn't give you before or all this attention all this effort here they're they're gonna like try to make something up but like i said with this person is coming from a place of like them being hurt and it's like they're gonna try to hand you everything on a silver platter but there's no intention of them actually making the change within and i think that you you could see or sense the changes within that they're not making or that they still need to make but also too by you being with this person this new person that is giving you everything giving you the communication that you want it makes it very easy for you to be like okay like i know now for a fact that what i had before going on was not it okay so i don't know let's see let's see let's see anything else spirit two of pentacles in reverse and three of pentacles in reverse yeah what did i say you guys this person is just like bullshit in here two of pentacles in reverse it's like they and it's sad because it's like they struggle between actually giving for real and like painting a picture of themselves but this person does not even know themselves it's like they can't communicate correctly what they'll do because they have no clue of who they really are or who they want to be it's like they want to make themselves over they want to be that person but it's like they have nowhere to start and they don't know how to communicate those actions so all they're really good for or all they really know how to do is give materially and to try to tie you up into the material things but it's not coming from a place that's like self self-assured it's coming from a place like i need to keep you on my string to make my ego feel better and that's not no nobody wants that <laughs> all right so what's the outcome spirit moon in reverse oh and the five of cups oh that felt the way that fell out of my hand was really weird i wish i could have saw that so yeah the five of cups and the moon in reverse okay still nothing nothing is going to get solved here because this person is going to paint an illusion. I'm almost getting like a sob story, like a, Oh, why won't you be with me? And don't you remember what we had? Don't you remember what I was able to give you? But it's like, yeah, you might've gave me like good material things too. Maybe great sex here and there or whatever, but you was also a snake. You snaked me. You, you sent a lot of BS in my life with this tornado. You, you, something about a mice here or something like that. Like you really just like didn't do the best thing for me. So let me get one more card for you. I think you're going to be able to speak this to this person too. Yeah, the world card. You're like, look, I'm not staying in that stagnant energy. I'm moving forward. And I feel like that's going to be the best bet for you too. Because it's like with the seven of wands, you have a lot going on in your life, whoever you are. Like not just partnership wise, but the way that you're maneuvering in life, like it's so different. It's so attractive. It's so magnetic. Like you can put your passion into anything right now, into this partner. And I think you're strongly considering it. Like I said, I like this person, this new person that you're dealing with, because they're like, look, I'm going to give you this. We're going to do that. And I feel like that's what you really need. And I feel like this person will lift you up more than the other person. But I feel like maybe there just may be some closure that needs to come in from you dealing with this person maybe this person needs closure more than you because i feel like you could give it to yourself but this person may need the closure so that way they know what you're not going to tolerate anymore all right so i'm going to leave it there you guys um thank you so much for watching um i hope the messages resonate i hope that you're doing amazing in your life like share and subscribe all that good stuff if you like this type of content and i'll, and I'll see you guys on my next video bye